Adam here from Auto Craze. Wow, 2019 definitely started off with a bang. You saw the LDV, you saw the Ranger. Now we've got ourselves the MP300 Navarro behind us, coming in for the full Auto Craze treatment. All right, guys, so it's come to the stage where we're doing the lift kit on the Navara. It's getting a two inch Dobinson's lift. What Jason's currently doing is doing a true hub to guard measurement on the vehicle to give us a true measurement of before and after. As you see behind us, Ben's actually getting the sports bar removed. What the customer wanted is wanted to get it powder coated black just to go with the whole theme of the car. So it's gonna look pretty cool. All right guys, so moving over to the front of the vehicle. Jason's currently getting the vehicle prepped up, ready to put the SLX front bar on. So he's getting the grill out at the moment and then the bar will come off, we'll be ready to go so we can start putting the SLX front bar on. Hey guys, the Navarro build is finally completed. As you see here, I've got my main man, John. He's actually the owner of Spoilers Car Wash. John, take it away. Yeah guys, uh, I'm the owner of Spoilers Car Wash, cafe located in uh, Greenacre. I bought this Navarro, pretty basic ST uh, Navarro, and then I wanted something a little bit different uh, about it. I don't want the standard uh, bush looking peak sort of a car. I wanted something different. So I heard about the boys, auto craze in Sawada. I, I do drive around and I've seen this place, so I actually walked in there, I saw uh, Adam and uh, the chaps here, and um, I just said, look, I want something different, something classy, something nice, and um, yeah, great work, guys. Appreciate it. So, John, I'm gonna run you through exactly what we've done on the vehicle. So, as you see, the beast is done. Now, guys, you see many Rangers, you see many Hiluxes, we thought it would be a bit different. We decked, the, we decked this Navarro top to bottom. So, John, as you see on the front, you wanted it to be a bit beefy, a bit bulky, so we opted for the SLX front bull bar. Really nice, it's got the hoop on the front so you can mount a light bar on there if you wanted to. I know you wanted to go that black thing, but wanted to keep a bit of chrome on the vehicle yep, as well that's too. that's right. Yep. So what we did for you, we've done the black grill with the chrome badge, right? We opted for the black flares as well too with the imitation bolts to give it that rugged look. That's right. Right? Yep. We also got your rear sports bar painted black as well too. Yep. And we kept the Mirrors and the door handles just chrome, just to give it that nice breakup of color. Yep. Obviously, John, also we opted to go with the Moto Metal MO970s and the Falcon Wild Peak yep. AT3Ws 275 5520. Perfect size to run. Come through, guys. 
John, obviously we lifted the vehicle for you. We went, we went with the two inch Dobinson's lift kit to make your life easier getting into the car being higher. There you go, exactly. we installed some short, short, <laughs> Someone with short legs like me, easy, yeah? <laughs> there you go, there you have it. Easy to come out. So e-boards, um, at nighttime we also opted to install the LED lights in there. So when it's nighttime, obviously it's gonna be a bit harder to see. Open the door, you'll be able to see your way through. So that's gonna make your life easier getting into the car. Yep. One other thing, you wanted your back secured, right? That's right. Show you something special on the back. So you, when you came in, there was nothing on the back, no tool, no cover, that's no right. nothing. Yeah. You carry a lot of stuff in there, so you wanna make sure it's locked up and secure. We opted to go for the electric roller shutter, make your life easier as well too. Press of a button, boom, go, roller shutter opens. LED light in there to make it easier to yeah. see at night time. Press the button, boom, it closes. Beautiful. Right? I love that option because um, you can actually, with the typical lift, one that goes up there, doesn't give you much scope on height. This one's just terrific. Stop and start wherever you want. It's actually, I love that feature. Again. All right, John, so another feature that this roller shutter has, so you open it up. So for example, you're going to close it. If something is obstructing its way, the roller safety shutter will feature. stop. So it's a safety feature. Awesome. Okay? Lovely. Also another thing to make your life a lot easier as well too. Let's unlock, let's lock the car. So it's got the central locking in the tailgate. Yep. Let's unlock it. Easy, no injuries. No injuries. Very nice, easy up, easy down. Yep. If you try to lift it for me, John, look how easy it goes up as well too. It's not heavy, right. you know what I mean? Makes sense. So let's close this up. Okay. All right guys, so there's another feature that we added to the car. So obviously being at the spoilers car wash, the car's gonna be parked at the front. He wants it to be a real big attraction for his, for his business. You know, he's gonna get the car wrapped eventually. Because it's gonna be left vacant at the front, he wanted it to be safe. He wanted to know that he can leave his car there and not have to worry about it. What we installed in the car for you, John, is the iRoad dash cam. So it records front and rear. Right, if you see the back window as well too, it's got one yep. in the back window. Connected to your phone via Bluetooth, you can constantly watch live footage of the vehicle while it's parked. Matt, that tops it all up. That actually uh, it makes it nice, complete, four by four, and unique. Okay. All right, guys, there you have it. The Navara's done. Let us know in the comment section below what you want us to do next. Any builds, anything that you can think of, just throw it in the comment section. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned.